Today's Daily Dose of Math is part two in the series, What is a Square Anyway? In part one, we talked about the basic facts about a square, and we looked at the definition of a square. But now in part two, we're asking the question, is a square also a rectangle? And is a rectangle also a square? Well, the answer is going to be yes and no. Let's look at the definition of a square first. A square is a quadrilateral that has four congruent sides and at least one internal 90 degree angle. We can see in this diagram of a square that the four sides are congruent as shown with these little lines and that it in fact has four internal 90 degree angles as shown with these little squares on the corners. Now is a rectangle a square? A rectangle has the four internal 90 degree angles, but it doesn't necessarily have four congruent sides. Instead, it has two pairs of congruent sides. Now let's look at the definition of a rectangle. A rectangle is a quadrilateral that has two pairs of opposite congruent sides and at least one internal 90 degree angle. Very similar to the square, but it doesn't have to have four congruent sides. The four sides have to be broken down into two pairs of sides that are opposite and that are the same length. Therefore, a rectangle is not necessarily a square because it doesn't necessarily have to have four congruent sides. A square, though, is a rectangle because a square has the at least one internal 90 degree angle. And yes, you can say it has two pairs of opposite congruent sides. Even though all four sides are congruent, we can still say that it has two pairs of opposite congruent sides. So the answer to today's question, is a square a rectangle, is yes. And is a rectangle a square? Usually, no. This is part two of what is a square anyway. Today's daily dose of math. Please like, subscribe, and share.